And welcome back, everybody. Hello, YouTube, and all of our Sparkly Squad friends and members and families out there. We want to welcome you to another edition of What We Are Making Glow Today. Yes! I'm going to go at the very end, but starting us off is our good buddy, Shine. Here we go. I think he said he was making his second neon for his road to mega for this so let's see which pet we are looking at it looked like a king bee to me guys that looked like a king bee yes nice shine and he confirms it second neon Halfway, buddy. Great job. All right, up next is my husband, Mr. SP Trainman. Go, Daniel, go. Woo, get it. You guys, Daniel plays this a lot less than I do, so when he gets a chance to make a neon, it is very special. That is a lot of his work culminating over many weeks. And it's a beautiful purple neon raccoon, yas, which he comes over and gives to his wife politely for free because he loves her and he knows how much purple means to her. No, I'm just teasing. You should see the look on his face right now, though, you guys. Ah! <laughs> I got him. Oh, my God. <laughs> his face. <laughs> I got you, buddy. All right. Up next is our good buddy, Miss Mia. <laughs> Miss Mia, go! <laughs> yes! Beautiful pet name. You are welcome. <laughs> Alright, as usual, we're experiencing some lag. And you can see that when Miss Mia's running in one space. <laughs> it does happen. She's going to make it through it, though, you guys. Oh, here we go. And here we go, Neon. Oh, another Neon Raccoon. And she politely comes out. No, I'm teasing. <laughs> All the purple Neons to sparkles. <laughs> <laughs> no big deal. <laughs> Up next is our good buddy, Miss Haley. Woo! Go, Miss Haley, go! Took a lot of time out of her limited schedule right now, you guys. She's working so hard to get those limited in games, but she stopped so that she could come and make her neons. Ooh, there's a neon chimera that's following her, too. Or Crymere? What did we decide? That was last Halloween, remember? Was it a hard C? Was it a soft one? I think we had to look it up. Crymere? I think we had to look it up last year. Not a word um, or a pet I typically know. <laughs> Ooh, the Maleo bird! Double trouble! Look at that! Maleo bird! Which ones are those, ma'am? Is that one, two, three, four? What you got going on? Hashtag Road to Mega, you guys. Yes, three and four. Road to Mega. And that means it is my turn, everybody. Woo! And I am going to have my alt make it. <laughs> yes. Because my alt has the neon and the mega task, you guys. So it will get four boxes from this. So here we go. Black macaque away. And you guys, once I'm done with this, that means I only need to do the Komodo Dragon for the East Southeast Asia Egg to be finished. Yes! One last final pet. Aw, it's so cute! Yes! Look at that. Super duper awesome. Oh my goodness. Very, very cute pet. Very happy to be almost done with the Southeast Asia eggs, you guys. 
Oh my goodness. I'm going to have my alt uh, trade me real quick and get those boxes off of them. Did anybody else get RGB boxes that they would like to open right now? Let me know. Let me see if I see any yeses because I saw different alts out. So I'm pretty sure that um, people got boxes, huh? Yes, I see yeses. It's always good to actually gather the boxes before you try to trade them, you guys. <laughs> and since this alt is rarely on, I'm just going to take everything that she has on her. Which, by the way, is not much. <laughs> but she did have that, and she made that mega black macaque. Oh, so cute! So we are just going to grab that up real quick and those boxes. And you guys know we can't let this beautiful black macaque not be a rideable pet. So as soon as I get it in my hot little hands, we are going to make it ride. And that way we can ride it while we open these boxes. Yes! Let's just pop that beautiful black macaque out. Oh yeah, you guys saw it. It is coming soon. Those moose are getting aged up. Coming soon. Oh, whoops. It's not what I wanted to feed it. Oh, are you going to come over here? Where are you going, macaque? Make up your mind. Goodness. All right, there we go, guys. Black macaque getting its ride potion. Yes, now we can ride our pet. Oh, look at him. He's cool. All right, let's get our gifts out. Are we ready, folks? <laughs> I know, right? I had to make some sound effects. No big deal. <laughs> here we go, guys. And I'm just going to talk it out here because every... Well, Shine's not in, so let's go ahead and type it. Three, two, one... Open, 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 open those boxes. Oh, mine did not open. There it goes. Ooh, RGB friend. Oh, check that out. Daniel is making his raccoon ride. He's getting that bad boy ready. What fun is it, you guys, unless you make him ride and fly, right? Like, we got to make him ride and fly. And you know what? We are coming up to the end of this month and the beginning of my favorite, favorite month, which is Halloween. So we are going to get ready to be doing all sorts of things. And I've got some ride and fly potions that I'm going to be giving away in game through some um, in game games. So you guys hope you guys check it out and are around for some of these wonderful in game games that I am doing. Yes, trying to help people get rich. Let's get rich together. Come on, squid and or chameleon. Here we go. Ledge, ledge, ledge. Good luck. Open, open, open. Oh, why my boxes keep disappearing, you guys? So crazy. Here we go. Oh, pogo stick, Daniel. Oh, I got an RGB friend again. Ooh, monster truck. Nice, Miss Haley. Nice. All right, here we go. Last gift for me. I'm just going to open three today, you guys. Hopefully this one will open right. Here we go. Three, two, one. Good luck, everybody. Open, open, open. Oh, phone throw. <laughs> okay, well, it's all toys and fun stuff right now, huh, guys? That is A-okay. Hey, we twinned. All right. The phone. <laughs> well, no ledge today, but that's okay, guys. We have something amazing to show you. Yes, we are working on a new build. And it is this year's scary, super scary, haunted mansion maze yes oh if you guys see me flipping stuff that's just my dyslexia don't worry about that also I'm talking at the same time as I'm typing so you know it gets a little conjobbled sometimes on the way down <laughs> 
But yes, we have a new haunted house maze that we are building, and you guys, it's crazy. Let's go check it out. This is just a sneak peek of this house. Yes, let's go check it out. Here we go. Just a sneak peek of a cool event that we are building for at the end of next month, you guys. We are going to do, of course, our trick-or-treat event, but we're going to do it in this house. Brand new haunted maze by the Sparkle Squad. Enter if you dare. We are still constructing it, guys, but you can get from the beginning to the end. I'm still constructing the very top fourth level. Yes, you heard it. There are four levels inside of our haunted mansion. And the first thing is a trick. Because you guys know trick or treat, we got to have the tricks. So we have this lovely, wonderful elevator that will take us up into what will be the vampire bat cave. Yes. But you guys, check it out. It is an actual maze. One built by yours truly in a night of fervency. Yes. You guys know I was sick last week. I was starting to feel better. And the night before last, I was like, we need to build ourselves a wonderful, partially scary, super awesome, bat cave maze haunted house. So check it out, you guys. We are not even at a third of what I've built. We're going to jump down right here. Oh my goodness. And we are chasing people down in the maze. You see them in front of us? We're chasing them down. Now, I have started in one area, one area only, to make some decorative stuff. And here it comes, you guys. And you can see Corrupted Ringmaster Shine says, Ew. <laughs> <laughs> oh, what could he be speaking of, we wonder? <laughs> Look at all of this wonderful blood in our blood alleys. Wako says, how did you do this? <laughs> yes, the haunted bloody hallways. And then, oh my goodness bloody rivers to jump over you guys dear goodness what kind of builds are you guys doing for this haunted halloween because i'm gonna tell you right now we about to have a lot of fun in this one come closer to halloween we will indeed play some games where you will get to say trick or treat to my alts and get a prize from each one you guys I have seven alts. That means seven prizes. Oh my god. Whatever will you do with so many prizes? Oh, uh oh. I see something that got deleted. <laughs> Don't fall down into the lowers. Da, da, da. Keep going, keep going. Oh, oh no, someone fell below. They are trapped in the eternal abyss. Quick, Wako Mia, TP to me. That is our one and only area that you cannot get out of right now. Let's go back this way, guys, and I'll show you the way. Woo! <laughs> Here we go. A very tiny opening. Don't fall inside. You will go back down to the last level. There are some traps, you guys. There are some traps. If you rage quit my maze, I will not be upset at you. Let's just say that right now. It is long. It is arduous. There will be a lot of stuff to scare you along the way. Do not be afraid. It's just a game, guys. It's just a game. <laughs> Woo! Creepy laughs out of sparkles. Oh my god. It's almost the month of her favorite holiday. Okay, so like right here, not quite done with walls, but that's okay. So this is the fourth floor, you guys, that's not done yet. We will be turning this into more work around so that you get to go all the way to the back back here, which will have a hidden secret Halloween-inspired grinder as well. 
right back here. Yes. And as we get close, so close to finishing the walls <laughs> and having this be all zoned in, this will be your exit area right here. Now you guys can choose to walk down, but what's the fun in that when you could sit and slide down <laughs> into the mess below? Yes. And you will see, it does feel like right about here, it's taking a long time to get out of here. It's like, oh my god. But right here, you'll have a little side mission of four unholy terror rooms to geek out and explore. And then you will end your maze mission through this area and out the actual exit. Yes! And here at the end, we still twist and turn to make you work for it. Yes! This maze will be insane, and I cannot wait to do it. If you guys are wondering how I did the blood alleyways, I will give you a hint right now. It was the mermaid hot tub. And I made that mermaid hot tub all red, all of it red, and then I expanded it out to include the entire house. Then I lowered it down until just the top layer was, was visible. So just the top layer is visible in those areas. There are some tight areas, aren't there, Waco? There are some tight areas in there. I love it. Yes, Waco shows you this is the mermaid hot tub right here, you guys. It is the biggest hot tub in and of itself. And so once you get the space that you want to put this in, you want to put this hot tub right in the middle of the space that you want to fill. Then you want to expand it out as big as you can. It's going to look really weird because you're going to end up inside of the hot tub as you're expanding it. So you're going to kind of do a little bit of guessing too. Then you're going to lower it down until you can only see the top level of the edge of the mermaid bath. And that concludes our slight preview of our haunted maze and our, oh, there it went, you guys. You see that? But you got to make that water red. When you're in the color, make sure you make every part of this red. And I'm going to show you just real quick. Let me just show you real quick. To pop it up you see that secondary is blue change that to red too you guys you see that tertiary change it to red too you see the next one change it to red too then everything is red now I like to use the really dark red like the super vampire dark red oops and then look I didn't confirm it I'm so silly um it happens you guys I like to use the really really dark red and that way we get a really really dark red at night and then during the daytime it doesn't lighten up too much and so that's what it looks like you guys and then you can make it super super big and then you still put it into the ground and you can make pools and puddles and have you know the bubbles boiling up and stuff it's a lot of fun be creative use all of the things that we have in there and just change the colors you guys let's see what kind of builds you guys can make out of all the wonderful things we have in here yes as always guys we're gonna remind you before we leave of some very important things as I get into here <laughs> and I'm hidden inside of the water of course we're gonna remind you to sub like to comment and to share you guys sub like comment and share we need you guys to share. The more you share, the more other people know what we're doing. If you think no one's watching you, it's fine. When you share, you let YouTube know people should be watching us. Yes, as always, if you're too young to actually comment here, we have our group in Roblox and it's called Sparkle FAF. The FAF stands for friends and family, guys, because we are building a community. A community of people that not only want to get rich together here in this game but want to support each other in real life as well if that sounds like a place that you want to be come on down guys and join the sparkle squad today we are accepting good-hearted members every single day 
As always, we also want to remind you to keep your server safe. Whatever game you're playing, guys, keep yourself safe, no matter where you roam. And as always, stay sparkly. Still sparkly, everybody! Yeah! Let's go play! Come on! <laughs> This is a hot tub of blood!